shots together and then create a situation that doesn't give them the best chance to succeed. I see a lot of players take their sand wedge lob wedge and get it way far back in their stance and kind of mix up the two shots. Here's a simple way to handle it and I'm going to show you right now. Not very hard but it's going to get a lot better results for you. First we set up like normal with our full trajectory shot. I've got a seven iron here in my hand. The ball is front of center closer to my front foot. To hit the chip or running shot, we're going to step in even with the ball. So we'll set up like normal, step in. Second thing we want to do on this shot is make sure we follow through. Now notice where I'm at. I'm finished to the front and the toe of the club has swung over. I'm not stopping or blocking. I'm letting it go. Now understand the chip shot is going to run lower, not have a lot of loft, and it's going to run out for you. Keep this in mind when you're choosing a shot around the edge of the green. I'm sure you're going to find a big difference when you use a straighter face club and this technique.